my surprise. He did the mash. He did the monster mash. The monster mash. It was a graveyard smash. He did the mash. It caught on in a flash. He did the mash. He did the monster mash. Hey everybody, I am 22 Tiger Dude and I am here to review the ABC first ever Pixar special, Toy Story of Terror. Before I review Toy Story of Terror, my guest star, Cinemadness, is going to review it. So, Cinemadness, take it away, dude. Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing Toy Story of Terror with 22 Tiger Dude. Um, I will have spoilers in this review because I... It's a 22 minute special, so there really was no other way to do it. So, I'm going to go over the plot real quick. Um, Bonnie and her family are going on a vacation, and they take the toys with them. And um, they stop at a motel to uh, spend the night. And um, Mr. Potato Head decides to go around, despite the advice of Mr. Pricklepants, who um, told him he was it was classic horror movie scenario. And Woody said that toys get lost in motels so easily don't go, and he went anyway. And Mr. Potato Head gets lost. And then, um, Woody, Buzz, and all the other toys all get kidnapped. And later on we find out that, um, they were actually being put in glass and being sold illegally by this guy. And, um, the end credit scene's hilarious. Um, they did a really good job with that. Um, so I wanted to talk about uh, a couple things that I liked about it and one thing that I didn't like about it. Uh, the one thing I didn't like about it was when they're all trapped in the glass, it really kind of felt like Toy Story 2 where they get, uh, the Chicken Man tries to sell them and stuff. But the things that I did like about it is it's a great story. Um, you want to come back and watch it next year. And a lot of these specials that come on for the holidays, you watch it once and you're like, eh, I really didn't need to watch it. And, um... This one just does a really good job of making it uh, part of the franchise. Um, the story is great and original and funny. Um, so I'm going to give Toy Story of Terror an A+. Um, it just it does what it's supposed to do. And if you like the original Toy Story movies, I'm sure you'll love this. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say about it. So. Thanks for watching, and stay classy. Thank you so much, Cinemadness, for reviewing Toy Story of Terror. You guys, please check out Cinemadness. He was actually originally Movie Madness, but he's barely getting started on his new channel, Cinemadness, and I'm sure it's going to have more reviews and such. So please subscribe to his new channel, Cinemadness, and I'll leave the link to his new channel below help him out support him he's a very nice guy now toy story of terror before i review this of course basically everyone in this world loves the toy story films if you don't love the toy story films what the hell's the matter with you but anyways <laughs> i actually own all three of the toy story movies look i got toy story on vhs Toy Story 2 on VHS, Toy Story 3 on DVD, I even have a Buzz Lightyear stuffed animal, I am that huge of a Toy Story fan, look at this, wow, I love all three of the Toy Story films, they just get better and better each movie, but I love them all combined, they're basically like one gigantic epic animated film for me, Toy Story of Terror. This is the first ever special by Disney Pixar. Of course, I was excited for Toy Story of Terror. Although, I wish it was an hour long instead of 30 minutes. It feels like you don't really get enough of something in 30 minutes. But, I really did enjoy the special. It was really cool and I thought it was a lot of fun. It was really funny. There are a lot of moments to really enjoy. There will be moments that adults can understand that kids probably will understand with some of the references. One of them being a reference to Predator, which I thought was super clever as hell. And I really enjoyed that the special went for that. The storyline just for this special, I thought it was really well done. Like I said, the humor, there's a lot of funny moments in the special. 
It's really good to see the toys again. Although I did notice a few toys missing, like Ham wasn't in the special. I'm guessing they couldn't get John Ratzenberger to do the special. And Slinky Dog, he wasn't in the special. Mrs. Potato Head wasn't in here as well. So there are a few toys that you notice know not in the special. And that's probably they couldn't get the actors to do the special because maybe they were too busy or such. But they do have most of the toys back and it's good to see them back. It's nice seeing Woody back. It's nice seeing Buzz back. It's nice seeing Jesse back. Mr. Potato Head back. Rex back, you know. And it's nice seeing the new characters that we saw in the special. It was just very creative. This one, it feels rushed a couple of times. And that's really my only issue with the special. And Jessie, she got a bit annoying with her fear, like just breathing in and out, like <gasps> not a whole lot though. Those are my only flaws. The special is really good. I did really enjoy it. And I think if you're a fan of the three films, you're either going to just enjoy the special or love the special. I think it's a well done special. And it's a special I could really go back to every year. And I'm glad it's not a special that's rushed all the way through. They did cram in as much as they can in that short 30 minute time limit. It probably would have been better if it was an hour long. I would have loved to have seen it an hour long. But for what they try to give us in less than 30 minutes, I think they did a pretty damn well done job. And then the whole after credits scene in the special, oh my god, that was hilarious. That was probably one of the most hilarious after credit scenes I've ever seen. Like seriously, I was busting out laughing. A lot of parts in this special really made me busting out laughing. I really enjoyed it. And this is a special I will definitely revisit every year. So, Toy Story of Terror. It's not a perfect special, but it's definitely an extremely enjoyable special that I will definitely watch every year to get into the nice Halloween spirit. And it's really nice to see a Pixar special. And I really do hope to see more Pixar specials come in the future because that would be very interesting to see. So, I am going to give Toy Story of Terror to infinity and beyond a 9 out of 10. God, I love the Toy Story movies. I just love it. I am 22 Tiger Dude. Don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.